Every so often, there's a pitching prospect that takes the game by storm. And the Yankees got their hands on one. 21-year-old Jorge Guzman. The 6'2 Dominican flamethrower came over in November of 2016 in the trade that sent Brian McCann to the Astros. Upon his arrival, though, the Yankees took notice of his erratic mechanics and went to work. One of the biggest things when we got him in spring training was his delivery. It was inconsistent. We simplified it down to one delivery out of the windup and one delivery out of the stretch, and it has made a tremendous difference with his ability to execute pitches in the zone. I know you all, man, and when I was in the Astros, I had a mechanic that was very rapid, like this step. Like this step, and when they changed me, I was in Tampa, Estaba tirando así mismo y me dijeron que no, que, que así yo podía seleccionar, me tirando tan rápido, que, que me quedara con el pie un chico de octavo. Bueno, yo he venido trabajando porque cuando yo estaba en, en los astros, yo la verdad yo no tiraba bastante strike como estoy tirando ahora. Y ahora siento que he desarrollado, he desarrollado mucho ¿no? como pelotero. Since his mechanics have been corrected, Guzman has been no match for the competition. He's putting up video game-like numbers for the Staten Island Yankees and continues to improve every time he toes the rubber. His composure and maturity on the mound are well beyond his years, and it's evident in his approach. He is such a delight to watch. He, he just goes out, he attacks hitters. To just go out and watch him perform on the field and his ability to get out of jams and to put hitters away, it, it's just charismatic. He goes after hitters and he doesn't shy away from them. That's obviously something that you want in a pitcher. You don't want a guy that's going out there and just kind of nibbling in the zone, doesn't want to get hit, you know, just he's he just competes. It's not his mechanics and mentality though that have people talking. It's his arm. His triple-digit fastball is one of the hardest thrown in the game, and it's exciting to see if you're on his team. Don't blink because that ball's coming in there. <laughs> 100, 101. Flamethrower. <laughs> it's incredible watching him pitch. You know? I love watching him throw fastball. He throws probably the hardest one in almost all of baseball. Oh, it's very exciting. He goes out there and throws 97 to 102. It's almost effortless when he throws it, and, and what's so amazing about it is he can sustain it through 100 pitches. In 13 years, I've never seen anyone that can carry it through an entire game like he does. He's not afraid to throw it early in the count. He's not afraid to throw it late in the count, and he's able to spot up with it most days, and that makes his off-speed stuff even better. As he progresses through the system, his fastball alone won't get the job done, and Guzman is quickly learning the value of mastering his secondary pitches. Yeah, we've spent a lot of time, you know, working on his changeup and developing his changeup, and now then he's just building confidence. He's learning how to use it in the right situations location, the ability to execute it in the zone, and to execute it out of the zone. And he's doing a great job, and that's kind of the next step we're at, is just him learning how to pitch with all three pitches. Though Jorge Guzman is young and needs time to fine-tune his game, he's undoubtedly equipped with the necessary tools for a bright future. He's already got three major league pitches. To me, there's no question that he's a major league starter on down the line, and he could be a major league reliever. You know, he's got the stuff and he's got the ability to do either one, but he already has the pitches. Now it's just learning the game.